So Google have just been fined with a huge 3.9 billion from the EU. In this video, we're gonna quickly go through why they've been fined and what it might mean for you. So first of all, the reason they've been fined is the European Union have been investigating them and accused Google of anti-competitive practices when it comes to their Android operating system. It's now concluded that Google has been acting uncompetitively and they've ordered them to pay 4.34 billion euros which is 3.9 billion pounds or 5 billion dollars so as they've previously investigated other companies for the same practices with microsoft they were complaining that internet explorer was presented as the default option for windows and not really given other choices so the reason google have been accused of uncompetitive practices are mainly because of the preloaded apps that come with android as you know when you get an android phone you generally get things like the google search Gmail, Google Chrome, all things used from Google. Now, personally, I've always been a user of things like Gmail, Google Maps, Chrome, so it's never been an issue for me, but they're saying that it's unfair and other apps don't get a look in. On top of this, since 2011, Google have required device manufacturers to pre-install both Google Search and Chrome browser in order to get access to the Play Store. And not only that, they also paid vendors and networks to preload Google Search app on devices. And this has resulted in the fine they've received. So as I've said, I use those apps, although practices such as that are very uncompetitive and I can see why they're being fined. So what will happen to you in the future if you've already got a device, it's not going to be affected by this, but a newer device could be affected. However, Google are arguing the case and they say that Android is actually all about choice and it provides a huge amount of choice to different phone makers and mobile networks. So the EC are suggesting that changes need to be made so it could allow manufacturers to sell devices with different versions of Android, like a phone powered by Amazon's Fire OS, which is still based on Android. Android, the EC believes that Google prevented this from happening in the past. But they've now given Google 90 days to issue a change in direction or they face further fines of up to 5% of its average global daily turnover. And as we all know, Google make a huge amount of money. So that number is going to be very big. But of course, Google aren't going to take this lying down. They are likely to appeal this decision. So we'll have to wait and see what happens. But please let me know your thoughts down in the description below. Do you like the fact that Android comes pre loaded with these applications or would you like it to be blank and actually have your own choice thank you for watching the video and please don't forget to like share and subscribe to the channel